Fan TV, CP here, my man Serato, the hottest sneaker customizer in the game. Yo, appreciate a couple minutes, my dude. Sure. Um, yo, tell us, how, how did you get your start on the customizer? Um, so, I, I basically started out, um, I, I was tattooing out of school, I, got, I did my whole apprenticeship, you know, did the whole thing, that was going to be my career. Um, got into it, it wasn't exactly like, I was in the right environment, didn't learn everything I wanted to learn, so I was like, maybe I need to pivot a little bit here. Downtime, I was still trying to practice my skills or whatever, so I grabbed some Converse's, Vans, you know, classic like canvas, you know, paint your shoes type shit. Yeah. And uh, I basically just went in there, grabbed some markers, some sharpies, and tried to do as much like flash, you know, tattoo designs, so everything on there, you know, bright cool colors, new schools type stuff. And I just kind of translated that from doing that to we decided to get a, you know, stand in the mall to try to sell a couple of them. Um, you know, I kept getting a lot of interest in the shop, you know, hanging them up and things like that. So went in there, started selling a couple of them, got my first couple of NFL. John Morant with what's up. And you did Duke Storm Fire, Zion, RJ, King, all that. What was that experience like? Man, that was crazy. That was one of my favorite things. That I, I mean, I never got, thought I'd get to work with, you know, with, you know, like an uh, institution like Duke. Yeah, and, you know, I looked at my DMs, you know, no one was in there, asked me if I could do some heat. Yeah. You know, told me he had something big. So I was like, all right, let's do it. Never looked back from that. So we got another starting five lineup this year. You know, they got the number one group class again. Okay. So it's going to be kind of, you know, fire to be real. Okay, okay. Is there any player, because now you're you crossing over sports, doing soccer, doing baseball, football, basketball. Is there any player who's on your bucket list? Like, yo, I love to design that kick for this player. Man, there's only one name on the list. LeBron James. I haven't seen LeBron on there. LeBron James. I did it. I got his son. I got yes. D Wade. I got Bosch. I got everybody on the list. I got Shaq. I got all of them. I did LeBron James. You know, everybody. Where is LeBron? LeBron, LeBron makes me look very good. I don't know if he's warm yet. Okay. I got to see it. Until I see it on his feet, I don't know if it's real. Yo, LeBron. We got a link with Serato, man. Don't make this man wait, man. Don't make this man I'm wait. I'm coming out to LA, man. Where, yeah. what's, what's going on? From a sneaker standpoint, is there any sneaker that you would like? I don't want to touch these. I just want to leave them as is pristine. Business-wise, not really. Right. I mean, right, right. it depends. I mean, you see my man with the paranormal forms on them. Yeah. Foams on over there. I probably wouldn't touch something like that just because there's really no reason. If you go right. get some foams, you can get any foams. But yeah. My personal collection, I think the only ones I wouldn't touch is the Air Max. You know, I can't do anything okay. to those, but. Other than that, everything's very good. Yeah. How about um from the Knicks? I know Ice is a big sneaker head. You ever done anything to launch the Uh we talked to him for a little bit. I haven't got a chance to give something out to him yet, but I'm working on it. Michael this season might be it. Okay, okay. Last question, man. You, you got the overtime connection. The YouTube channel. I love how you guys spin the content around what you're doing. Sure. Showing people the behind the scenes of the creative process. I love that part of it. What's next for Serato and your rest of the year and pull? Uh, I'm just gonna finish out the next you know, season two on the overtime, you know, the trick my kicks, you know, that show. I'm gonna finish that out and then uh, try to move on to another show we got in the lineup. So I'm gonna try to keep the content going and then hit the YouTube, uh, try to go on a little bit faster than when I get out now. So, okay, get the editor on there, gonna get videos out every week and that's kind of the plan. Yeah, I got some pictures of you, bro. All right, I appreciate yes. the hustle, man. I'm proud of you guys, Cedro, my guy. Let me know, keep up the good work, man. What's up? It's right on, man. Okay, phone posits. Yes. Okay. Orange and blue phone posits. Hold on, what else we got? There we go. That's two. Yeah. I had to buy them twice. It was so nice. Oh, wow. So nice he mm-hmm. bought them Just twice. So, Respect them. As you can see, the bottom is like one of them is yellow and then one of them yeah. is okay. crispy. Yeah, so you yeah, see. I had the one pair I was wearing all the time. Yeah. And I had the one pair. You, you know, throw them in the vault.